Welcome back, everyone. Time for some more RimWorld. Uh, I'm going to start off the show with apologizing for my audio. I have uh, I had a problem with my mic, and so now I'm having to record this with my headset mic, which is not so good. Um, as headset mics never really are. They're not designed for this kind of thing. Um, so we're going we're gonna to deal with it for now, and then um, I'll try and get a new mic as quickly as possible. I'm gonna expand the prison a bit. Try to get this place set up pro a little bit, pro a little bit better. Let's see, let's set that as medical. And the colony's cruising along. I feel like, well, you know, not so bad. Unfinished steel, small sculpture going on there. Chewie's got 90 something work left. 296 work left to do. He'll get around to it. What else is everybody doing? Lur is at 11% and did not join us. Oh, somebody was telling me I need to deal with this guy. And they're probably right. But, uh, I kind of want him to, I could kind of see him as our mascot. This is Boozy. Boozy the squirrel. Um, still having power problems, it looks like. Which is not good. Alright, so let's think about power. What are we going to do about power? Hmm... We can probably fit... Where can we put another one of these? Right next to it? Let's do that. This whole lack of a hydro hydrothermal vent is getting to be a bigger problem than I thought it would be. <laughs> I haven't played without one in a very long time, so... It's a little bit, of, a little bit more of an issue than I thought. Don't mind us, Lur. We're just uh, renovating your home here. Hey! Welcome aboard Lur. That was kind of unexpected. So this is non-medical. He can sleep there until his bedroom is finished. Which we should probably work on finishing. Put that there. Stick some wood floors down. A little potted plant for the guy. Standing lamp right there. Alright. Alright, well, we can turn this stuff off in here now, because nobody's staying in there. Save us a little bit of power. Gun turret cooling is done. Alright. What do we want now? I guess hydroponics, maybe? I mean, our food situation is mostly okay, but might as well. Where are you, Lur? There you are. What are you wearing? I don't mean that in a sexy way. I just want to get you better clothes if I can. Got a poor pair of pants. You've got a shoddy parka. This is a good parka. Come wear this. Right, you wear that. And actually, this is superb. Wear that instead, man. Put that get bad boy on. Uh, some poor quality pants, some poor quality shirts, but that would probably be better than the tribal wear you're wearing. Yeah, come put this piece of poor quality pants on. Yeah, I guess I'll let you know you ditched the tribal wear altogether. Okay, and we'll put in this poor quality shirt. All right. Chewie's back to researching, so that's fine, I guess. Alright, we got a bigger prison now. That's good. Let's haul this stuff out of here when they get a chance, which I think means we need more space. Yep. Got attackers. Seem to be a lot of them. It's starting to be problematic, I gotta say. It's getting to be a few too many. Alright, let's, let's, uh... Lur, where are you? You don't have a weapon of any kind. Lur, where'd you go, my friend? Chewy, Pope, Lur, there he is. Where are you going? Stone cutting? Oh, okay. We need to give you a weapon. We don't have any guns, do we? <laughs> Gonna need to buy in some guns, it looks like. 
What are you actually good at, Lur? We don't know the... Wait, let's get to know Lur. What makes Lur tick? He's a decent melee guy. Psychically hypersensitive, which is not something I'm really excited about. Alright, my friend. Do we have a great bow, at least? Yeah, we've got a great bow. Come get this. Not exactly what I would call a good weapon, but it's, uh, it's better than nothing. You're hearkening back to your heritage, is what's going on. That's what we're working on here. Anybody want to build this, by the way? Construction guys? Let's put Lur on a bunch of stuff. Looks like he loves art, so that'll be his first thing. He's an okay warden. We'll put him there. Put him on cooking. Bump him up on all this, the basic stuff that needs to get done. Alright. Alright, they're coming. All right, everybody. Except for you, Nicole. Oh wait, you have a gun. Never mind. You can take a break from your sick bed. All right. I hope we have enough power to make this work. Um, Links, come stand down here. Isadora, you can come stand down here too. You're my backup, guys. Chewy, you come stand there. Pope, stand here. Nicole, stand. Here? No, I don't want to stand there. There we go. These are my backup guys in case they get too close. Why are you not shooting, Chewy? Alright. You guys are on. Where is this guy going? Zidora, can you go kill that guy? He's doing weird things. There we go. Alright, everybody. You're free. Looks like we got two casualties here. That's not so bad. Turn these guys back on. I suppose casualties wasn't the word I was looking for. Survivors was the word I was looking for. Everybody's gonna take a lie down. Nicole. Actually, Lynx, you're, uh, you're out and about. As soon as you turn that stuff on. Alright. Let's take a look at the two people that have survived. We've got Ian, the botanist. Good grower, good researcher. Teetotler, sanguine. I want... I want Ian on our team. How about Creo here? Croyo? Croyo, I guess I pronounce that. Depressive, steadfast, tolerant. They're both nice. I gotta say. I don't have problems with either of these, but Ian is the Ian is the clear winner. Oh Chewie's doing healing. Nicole, can you come do this for me? Can you come get Creo here? Creo. Croyo. Alright, let's take a look at Ian. 99%? Yeah, he's not gonna join us. We should probably just release him. Sorry, buddy. You would have made an awesome addition to the team. You're also 99%? Alright, you know what we're gonna do? We are gonna make an effort to capture Ian, because Ian is great. Not that it's gonna work, but, um,. Oh, not execution. Release. And then we're just going to get rid of Croyo there. Running out of power again. And start blinking out. Yep. I'm going to turn this back into a hospital bed. Larry doesn't need to sleep in the hospital anymore. Oh, he died. You're working on that. Lur, can you come uh, strip this guy, please? 
And I need you to come do some of the, the crappy work here. Oh, there's somebody else alive. Didn't see this guy. Neurotic green thumb. Lur, can you grab... Capture this guy? It's probably too late. It's been a while. Restrict all this nonsense. Since you're here, Pope, you want to strip some bodies? Raymond is going to strip that guy? Oh, I don't know. Alright, let's look at Banna. Eric Banna. Alright, you could actually join us, so let's uh, make an effort to grab you. Not expecting it to work, but you never know. How's Boozy doing? Healthy? Boozy the female squirrel? This has run out of power. Actually, why is this like this? That's weird. Alright, so that's now online. So hopefully we're gonna get start getting enough of a surplus during the daytime to uh, make this work. Can you strip these bodies, please? I know I unrestricted them before, so it's my own fault. Yeah, you're gonna eat amongst all the bodies? That's just gross, dude. Don't do that. Don't be gross. Oh, we have visitors. It's a superior cloth, cloth parka in there. Who's wearing something crappy? You've got a superior cloth parka. Normal 88. Cloth parka awful 85. Come get this, man. Anybody else? We got another superior one. Oh, 30%. Never mind. Orders, haul things, sort of all this. We got no place to put that stuff. Alright, zone, dumping stockpile, right there. Clear all chunks. It's our overflow chunk spot. Hmm. Nope, apparently we can't get enough. <laughs> can't get enough uh, during the daytime. Alright, so we can also turn these off. I'm going to turn the light off in here too, even though somebody should be doing some work in there occasionally. The suggestion was made that I deconstruct this wall, and it's probably a good one. So let's uh, deconstruct All of that. I'm gonna leave one post behind to make sure that the oh blight killed our cops. Leave a post behind to make sure nothing um gets in the way. You know the the ceiling doesn't fall down. Those are the words I was looking for. All right, growing zone. Uh, that that's not gonna grow right there. All right. It's gonna be what? What did I? What am I growing there? Potatoes? Sounds good. Can we get away with just one of these? Or is it gonna get too cold in here? This might be too big of a room for one tim one heater. Let's see. But it'll help us it'll help us gain some power, which will be good. While we're waiting. Ian, why are you still down, my friend? Did you lose something? He lost his leg, okay. <laughs> I kinda wanna give Ian a peg leg, but I feel like that would be terrible. Oh, we you know what we never did? We built this little room up here. To hold our 
Is it weapons? Where would it be? Items? No. Art manufactured. Artillery shells. Yep, that's what it was going to be. So our artillery shell storage near our artillery mortars. But then we never may actually did the last little bit. You know what we're going to have to do with Ian? He needs a, he needs a leg. As much as I feel like our doctors are going to kill him, we got to give it a shot. It's all left peg leg. I feel like the, there's a high probability chance that Ian is dead. But it's okay, he was not going to join us anyways. <laughs> Wild boar's gone mad. And a group of pirates are here. What is this? Let's turn that off. Where are the pirates? Where are you, pirates? Oh, there you are. Oh no, they've got personal shields. It's the first time we've seen the personal shields in action. It should be interesting to see how this goes down. Are they all melee, though? They are all melee. Okay. This is the melee crew, which means, of course, that we're not going to get any new guns out of the deal, which is kind of lame. Did it work? Oh, he got a surgical cut. <laughs> on his... Leg, but he did get up his peg leg. Good on ya. Once we actually get a... Oh, they're coming. Alright, everybody. I need everybody here. Nicole, come stand there. Lynx, I need you over here. Isadora, I don't know, up here somewhere. Chewy, come stand here. Move up front. Oh, broke the shell. Oh, there we go. That'll do it. <laughs> come on. Can we get another one? I want their stuff. Nope, they're all gone. Raining. Strip these bodies for me, my friend. Is that guy's name Fugly? It was <laughs> Fugly. All right, so that's how the that's how it goes, I guess, when you have the um. Where is the switch for this thing? Oh, I didn't... There's no switch for this thing. Okay, let's turn that back on. Why are you carrying this back over here? Did you just decide you didn't want to butcher it after all? We're going to run out of power again. I haven't been getting enough wind lately. That's the problem. Ah, uh, good. It's handling the unpleasantness. Ian's at a 1% chance. We gave you a peg leg, my friend. I feel like you owe us now. Is this all hops? Did I actually make that much hops? We don't need this many hops. Alright, so let's see. Delete zones. Alright. We are not making that much beer. I'm going to finally do geothermal power in case we find a vent for it. You're not making enough beer to, to warrant this many hops. I'm going to delete all of this right here. Build a new growing zone in here, which is going to be corn, I guess. Yeah, build, let's get some more corn. Oh, okay, let's turn this off. That's a power sink we don't need. How come I can turn that, I can toggle that thing off without, oh no, I didn't toggle it off, it just lost power. Combat spires here, okay. Who's my best? It was Isadora before, but have I added somebody who's a better? Six, nine, no, three, eight. Still Isadora, it looks like. 
Oh wait, actually back up. Chewy, my friend, you are the new leader. Let's see what we can do here. We don't need these things. Great bow, great bow, great bow. Pila, pila, pila. Short bow, short bow, short bow. Limestone clubs. Ah, alright, cool. Do you have any weapons that I can get? I have a superior LMG for basically all of our money. I have a charred rifle for more than our money. Yes, we... you don't have anything. Buy some medicine. I'd like to make an actual hospital bed, so I need 10 medicine. So we're now paying them 50. That's annoying. Alright. Alright, uh, I'm going to stop here. Once again, I apologize for the quality of my mic. I will get it fixed as quickly as I can, but it might take a little while. Um, if you're enjoying it, please leave me a like, and I'll see you later. Thanks so much.